Okay, had a hot wire a car. I'm going to show you that it works first, and then I'll show you how I did it. Here's the, uh, the toggle switch to the ignition wiring harness. I'm going to turn it on. Windows don't work, air's not on. Now we hit the toggle switch. Lights, air, windows. Ignition, let's start it. Some pretty cool shit. You wanna shut the car off? Bong. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to locate the ignition wiring harness which is on the left side you got to break apart the steering column there's six wires it's hooked up into here what you want to do is you want to connect every wire except the blue one and when you want to start the car you just connect the blue wires to the rest remove it right away otherwise it'll fuck your starter up and what we did was we hooked up a toggle switch so we can turn it on and off but there's a problem that we ran into, the steering column locks. And in order to, f to get past that, there is this little piece right here that the ignition wiring harness goes into. You can see that the end of the lock cylinder goes into here. Just remove that. There's a little pin right there. We need to pull that out and turn that so the steering wheel cannot lock. But in order to do that, you need to pull out the lock cylinder. There's a pin right here, if you can see that pin. And that'll prevent you from pulling the cylinder out. So what you need to do is chip away at the side. Just pull the side off. And then you can pull the cylinder out. And then you can turn the steering wheel locking mechanism. You're free to turn your steering wheel as you want, as you please. It's as simple as that.